Welcome to Voodoo Agent, and today I want to talk about losing. Because part of this gig is you're going to win and you're going to lose. Last year was the best year I've ever had by a long shot, and I also lost more deals than I ever did last year by a long shot. Just in the third quarter, there was a million dollars worth of deals that literally slipped through my fingers. And it wasn't like I had nothing to do with it. I probably could have gotten some of that business. So on the upside, it's like if I had the best year of my life and I also like screwed up a bunch and I can, you know, look how much potential there is. And number two, there's always things to learn. I had this one, so it was really interesting. I had three deals I missed out on the fourth quarter and it was the same agent who ended up prevailing on every one of those deals. She's like my new hero. I mean, I'm way better of an agent than her, but she had the focus and the hustle on these particular ones way more than me. So one of the things, the, uh, some of the upside about losing, and I actually celebrate it. If I have a deal, I'm chasing a buyer or a seller, I'm trying to get a listing and I lose it, I drop it out of my consciousness. I'm no longer thinking about it. There are deals that you're, you're chasing after, or you have a listing that's a problem, or you have a buyer that you work forever, and it's just not in the cards. It's not gonna happen. So the moment it actually dies and goes away, it just opens up more opportunities. So uh, every time I lose a deal or lose a client or trying to get a listing or working with a buyer and it doesn't work out, I actually, like I, on my CRM, uh, there's a place where I can literally delete them or hide them so I don't see them anymore. And I always go, goodbye, Mr. Bond. And I press the button and, I, and I'm like happy they're gone. Because I know when people go, there's only so much space in your world. And when these deals go away and they're no longer there, you tend to focus on other things. You know, the people that I see that just really dominate in this business, I've noticed that they can lose big deals and it go, I'm always going, God, that must hurt. And the next thing they're on, another deal. You can't let that get to you. It's super key. I mean, there's so many people, they'll lose a deal and they'll be devastated and you'll have to pick them off the ground with a spoon. They can't even function for a while and they take it personally. So, you know, this is, tr this is true when it comes to athletes. It's true, you know, losing is part of the gig. So get used to it and celebrate it and realize that if you're missing a lot of deals, you have so much more potential than you currently have that when you finally get that together, you're going to even make more money. So I look forward to seeing you in another episode. Take care.